On older cars, side sliding doors should be checked. Roller type hinges wear out over time, which is why the doors do not close well and knock on bumps. Prestigious multivans were equipped with closers for closing the rear and side doors, in which their closing sensors fail over time. The multifunctional interior of the T5 provides ample opportunities for transformation, which makes the car versatile. The functionality of these machines is increased by the presence of two wheelbase options and three roof heights. Most often, the back door is solid and lifting. Swing-type doors are less common on cargo versions. Even for the smallest modifications, the volume of the cargo compartment is 5,800 liters, and for the long ones with the high roof, as much as 9,300 liters. Engine. In T5 turbo diesels, you only need to use oils that have VW approvals. For a 1.9-liter engine, 50,501 or 50,700, with a particulate filter, and 2.5-liter, 50601. Otherwise, there is increased wear of parts of the cylinder head, camshafts and their beds, hydraulic lifters, etc. 15 to 20,000 kilometers on the left oil is enough to disable the cylinder head. The timing of the 1.9-liter TDI and 2.0-liter gasoline engines are equipped with a belt, which is changed along with the rollers every 120 and 90,000 kilometers, respectively. A gear drive is installed in the timing of the 2.5 TDI engine, the same drive for attachments. By a run of 150,000 kilometers, the damper clutches of the generator and air conditioning compressor may fail, they are cut off, but this does not entail serious problems. The timing of the 3.2 liter engine is driven by a chain, which can stretch to 100 to 150,000 kilometers, and its hydraulic tensioner can wear out. By 100,000 kilometers in turbo diesels, the fasteners of the intercooler pipes weaken, malfunctions of the vacuum turbine control valves occur. After 150,000 kilometers, the booster and tandem pumps may fail. The sealing wheels of the pump injectors may lose tightness, due to which diesel fuel enters the oil system. In the 2.5 liter engine, there was a loss of tightness of the oil cooler. Lubricant enters the cooling system. A pump leak after 100,000 kilometers, antifreeze enters the oil. Among gasoline engines, the most trouble-free is the 2.0 liter. In 3.2 liters, in addition to timing faults, there was a failure of individual ignition coils. And it is also the most voracious, in the city, about 17.0 liters per hundred, although it provides the best dynamics, 10.5 s to 100 kilometers slash h, 2.5 LTDI 130 slash 175 HP, 15, 3s and 12.2 s, respectively. Weaknesses of the car. By a run of 100,000 kilometers, where was noted on the intercooler pipe fittings, all TDI. Inversions with a manual gearbox, especially when driving with overloads, after 100,000 kilometers, the damper flywheel may fail, there is a knock at the start of movement and gear changes. In a 2.5 TDI engine, the damper clutches of the generator and air conditioning compressor may fail for a run of 150,000 kilometers. Transmission. Hassle-free automatic transmission most T5S are front-wheel drive. The four-motion all-wheel drive transmission is more common in the multi-van. In general, four-motion has proven to be reliable, except that at high mileage, about 250,000 kilometers, the propeller shaft outboard bearings may wear out, a characteristic hum is heard during movement. However, at specialized service stations they are changed and the shafts are balanced. T5 were equipped with mechanical and automatic torque converter gearboxes. The automatic is more reliable, while in the mechanics, with runs of about 150,000 kilometers, spline connections can break, and after 100,000 kilometers the damper flywheel fails. In the clutch of 2.5 liter versions, the slave cylinder sometimes leaks. The oil in the manual gearbox does not change but in the automatic gearbox it needs to be replaced along with the filter every 100,000 kilometers. Suspension. The T5 has McPherson independent suspension at the front and double wishbones at the rear. Front and rear, anti-roll bars, which allows you to confidently stay on the road even during sharp maneuvers. The suspension is knocked down with good energy intensity. It differs in rigidity depending on the modification. After 60,000 kilometers, the consumables of both stabilizers are changed, up to 90,000 kilometers the rear silent blocks of the front levers, strut support bearings and ball bearings go. The rubber bands of the rear suspension arms last about 120,000 kilometers, 
the shock absorbers and front silent blocks of the front levers last 100 to 150,000 kilometers.